everybody! Thanks for coming back to my channel. So you guys, I did cut my hair. I'm so in love with it. And it really seems like you guys are too. So thank you so, so much for your sweet, sweet comments on Instagram. That really means a lot to me. I was like smiling and I got a lot of comments on it. So thank you so much. And even people um, in my workplace at school, they were like, hey, did you cut your hair? Like even people that I didn't don't talk to normally were noticing it. And I was like, wow, people are like looking at me a little bit more than I think they are so it's good that like I got a haircut right um, so today's video is going to be another tag video I was tagged by my good friend Shannon K on YouTube I will have her channel link below sorry but I'm not even gonna try pronouncing your name because sorry <laughs> it's just hard <laughs> um, but yeah she tagged me in another tag video it's called beauty community tag it's kind of like what you do on YouTube and why and all that stuff so we're just gonna get into it um, if you want to do this I'm going to have a few people listed below uh, but if you do YouTube and don't want to film a video although I don't know really how that works because the point of YouTube is videos but anyway if you would like to do this in the comments below that's fine too um, so let's get into it uh, this is a beauty community tag and let's go. So what are my favorite videos to watch? Definitely tutorials. I love Kathleen Lights' tutorials specifically because her setup is great and I can easily see what is going on on her face. Um, and she has a great personality too. Um, and her like camera setup, like she zooms in so you can really see what's going on on the eye. So I can't really, I, I like almost cringe when I see like a tutorial that's not set up well, but I still enjoy watching it in a way. Um, so tutorials and ta and also tag videos. I really have been enjoying that because we kind of brought them back. So go us. We brought tag videos back. Everybody did. Um, and also Project Pan videos. Now last year I wouldn't have said Project Pan videos just because I didn't see myself as a painter. But I'm kind of like getting into that like mode, mindset type of thing. So um yeah, I like watching those types of videos. What are my favorite videos to film? I would have to say tutorials. Um, I really get inspired by all of my makeup and all of you guys and all the people on Instagram. And it's just fun to create really good looks. Now, I haven't done one of those in a very long time, probably two months or so. Um, they are not the most fun to edit because they're just so long. But at the same time, they are fun to edit because it's fun to like add things in that it's fun to like get creative with it in a way um, and I do have a fun one coming up with um, a girl here on YouTube and I'm not gonna say your name because I'm gonna surprise you but I'm really excited about it so what are my least favorite videos to watch I would say PR hauls um, I hate PR hauls I think they're maybe they're not pointless because like maybe once in a blue moon I enjoy watching them just to like see what's new see all that stuff on Instagram so I just, I don't understand PR hauls, so that would have to be something, and what is your favorite part about the beauty community? Now, Shay, I believe her name is Lipstick, Lashes, and Wine, mentioned this in her video when she did this tag, that we both really love the tightness that the YouTube community, especially the beauty community, um, allows you to have. Um, I met my best friend on YouTube, Canoe. You guys know I, we hit it off to the point where like now I can't see her not in my life type of deal. So that to me is just like very, something very special and I would never have done that. I mean, I would never have met her if it weren't for YouTube or Instagram. And I guess the two are different because I can't remember exactly where we met. Because I think I had my channel first, but I convinced her to get one, so. Um, but yeah, I've met so many good people like Shannon and Michaela and Courtney and Danny and so many of you that like I consider my friend and I wish we could all just be in the same room like at some moment in life. I think that would be amazing. Um, so there are just so many people that I am grateful for for the YouTube community the beauty part of it, um, so I kind of touched up upon that in my answer. What is your least favorite part about the beauty community? I would have to say the brand bashing um, and the, um, 
who has more subscribers than the other person, who thinks they're higher up than the other person. I don't really like that. That's why I don't really watch many, like, um, uh, I don't watch many people who have high subscribers just because it's, like, too fake. Um, some people don't come across that way, like Kathleen Lights and Emily Noel, but others, like, I'm not gonna name names, um, I don't really like watching them, so, because of the number of subscribers that they have. So that's the least favorite part about the beauty community. Um, what motivated you to start your channel? I don't really know exactly, because... I remember the day that I did. I remember I was watching a tutorial, and I still I live at home with my family, right? So I was watching a tutorial, and I was like, "Hey, I've got a camera on my laptop, my MacBook Pro. That's like a dinosaur. I think I could just do that." So I went downstairs, and I was like. Hey guys, to my family, <laughs> I'm gonna start a YouTube channel. I'm gonna film a video. I don't even think I had a makeup at that point, but somehow I like found some or something. I don't remember exa exactly, but um, ever since then, I can't put the camera down and I can't stop taking selfies on Instagram. <laughs> like, it's just a lot of fun. So, answer to that question, I don't know why I hesitated there. <laughs> Hopefully that was a fun little story. Um, who most inspires you on YouTube? My friend Canoe. Um, a lot of you guys, Danny, Shannon, um, a lot of smaller YouTubers I would say because I feel like we're the most creative. So hopefully that answers that question. Number eight, number one thing you would change about the YouTube beauty community if we could be more welcoming to like new people um, and the whole thing with like the YouTube partnership changing I don't really appreciate that because now smaller channels won't be able to get big um, at least that was my understanding of it so I may maybe I would change that and along with that I would probably change the fact that I wish it wasn't a job for people I wish it was still a hobby Number nine, number one advice for other creators and new people starting out a channel. Um, oh, I had something really good when I thought about this. Um, it was like, don't expect your expectations, kind of, like, or don't set your expectations too high. Um, be yourself and don't set yourself a schedule because that's kind of in a way is setting you up to fail in a way um, like I kinda just do this whenever occasionally I have really good weeks where I'm filming a lot but then other weeks I go on for like three weeks and don't film the video but I don't put any pressure on it because I just have fun with it and it works out for me um, and don't worry about numbers too much don't look at your subscriber count a lot um, it won't do you any good, it won't make you succeed, um, as long as you keep doing what you love doing, which is filming videos, it will happen for you. For me, I've been stuck at 250 for the last year or so, but I know I haven't put in the work to deserve more subscribers, so yeah, that would be my advice to number one advice for people starting new a new channel. Okay. Number 10. What do you love about YouTube as a whole? Oh my gosh. I love talking about makeup. Um, I love makeup itself. I love trying out new products. I love everything about that. So that also helped me start my channel, which goes back to number six. Um, so what, what do I love about YouTube? I just love the fact that we can all chat with each other and you can make new friends on here and it's just a lot of fun. So anyways guys, that was a beauty community tag and thank you so much to Shannon and I just realized, I think Michaela, did you tag me in this video too? I can't remember, but thank you if you did. Um, I will have people listed below and uh, look out for more videos, especially that tutorial. 
I'm really excited about it. Okay, I'm gonna let you guys go and I will see you in my next one. Bye everyone. Hey, thanks for coming back to my channel. So, uh, yeah, in case you...